same thing over and over again. So, let's open it up and get started. below if you'd like some for yourself this is a monthly subscription box so you can try out some goodies delivered at your door every single month for super cheap and I love snacks <clears throat> in case you didn't know so uh, this is perfect for me I was really excited to be able to do this video again. The first stack I'm going to try is Taro Flavor Wafer. And I'm not quite sure exactly what this is yet. It looks like some cocoa chocolate balls or something of that nature. Open it up and see it for myself and let you know. Well, as soon as I opened it up, I could tell it's a wafer and it looks like a blueberry color. It's very interesting. It smells very strong. Taste is quite unique. It does taste just like a wafer. Um, I hope I'm saying that right because I know last time I said wafer and I didn't know what I was talking about. So, uh, anyway, this next one is very light and it looks like it's in Japanese. So, I'm not quite sure what this could be. I'm just gonna open it up. And it looks like one giant Cheeto. <laughs> so, let's hope it tastes like one too. sort of like fish. I think it's probably shrimp flavored if I'm not mistaken. Because I've had uh, Japanese chips that were shrimp flavored before. Uh, so this tastes exactly like it. Yeah, I'm gonna have one more bite. It's pretty good actually. But these snacks are typically from around the world so expect a lot of snacks that are in different languages. Speaking of Cheeto, 
Cross. Here's a purple Cheeto pack with a label over it promoting Batman or Superman. Batman versus Superman. I'm taking the label off just to show you the front. Jumbo Colmillos. <laughs> they look spicy because they're super red. And as soon as I did that, a bunch of the Cheeto crumbs just blew up in my face. So, if I start sneezing, it's not my fault. Also found this on the inside, I guess again, promoting Batman versus Superman. <laughs> so and try one of these. It looks like a ring actually. The way it's presented. Hopefully you can see. My autofocus can be f a bit funny sometimes because I have to put my hand in front. There we go. Next one is Western's Teriyaki Flavor Snack Stick. Smoke flavor added. I love this beef jerky stuff. like a tip typical um, beef jerky, like a Slim Jim that you can taste, except um, a bit less spice to it, I suppose. It's pretty good. It reminds me of a Polish sausage. Amsterdam good cookie. on the floor. It tastes exactly like an oatmeal cookie.
snacks are pretty good so far. Burritos, pizza rolas. I'm gonna be honest now, I don't like Doritos, but I have a good feeling about this because it says pizza. I don't like Fritos. Another one of these on the inside. I do wonder if this would be considered a joke. Not bad. It does taste like um, Pringles pizza flavor chips. That gets, gives you a general idea. Another Japanese looking container. Not sure what any of this says. But those of you who can read it or know what it is in general can let me something on the inside. It looks like chocolate, maybe. Let's see what's inside. And there's a cute little This is a temporary tattoo. I'm so wearing this. <laughs> I don't care what it is. I love temporary tattoos. I don't know why. It just looks like um, one of those milk duds or whatnot. Very crispy chocolate. Blendy potato stick cheese flavor. And again, if any of you know where any of these are from, which countries, please care to let me know. Tastes exactly like hardened french fries. If you like hard french fries, then 
That's the snack for you. Haribo, the Smurfs Sour Gummy Candy. sour. Still sweet. And extremely chewy. So I'm only going to chew one. Next one scares me because of the face. Oh. If you're scared of creepy faces, look away. Mm. But it looks like it could be something lemony. And maybe not so edible right now. Because it does feel like powder. So I'm assuming that you put it in water. a yellow thing that's coated in like white powder and it's probably more chewy than the last gummy I just chewed I can see why his face is for you. Definitely not for me. Mm. Too sour. Pay cake with cocoa. Mm. This actually looks like Something Eastern Europeans would package in or eat. How cute is this though? It's just a chocolate cake wrapped and packed nicely little slices. You could just sort of rip off and eat. I thought you could rip it off, but I guess you have to slice it. It's just like a light fudge brownie.
these imported snacks taste healthier than the typical junk food in America. And probably for a lot of reasons, too. And this last snack that I have in the munch pack box is cream colon, colon. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. This is a wheat cracker. Hmm. I do wonder what's inside. very strong as soon as you open it, but just crackers filmed filled with the type of cream on the inside. If you like a creamy filling snack, then this is the type of food for you. Again, it's in, uh, seems to be what's Japanese on the side, so maybe it's from there. Hmm. I just keep eyeing that beef jerky thing over there. I'm definitely gonna eat that later, finish it, but all there is in this box that was how many snacks probably I think there's typically 10 in there so in this box they can fit quite a lot and for the price I think it's pretty reasonable and fair especially if it's imported so that we all know imported things can get 